got it. <laughs> you lift this up, put it back on the rocker, and as you're sitting, you can just rock the baby. Oh, Benjamin, you look so When I had a baby five, six years ago, none of this stuff was available that you see out there right now. Strollers that you can, you know, fold down with a push of a button, portable, you know, bassinets that are, um, you know, really high end, beautiful to look at, yet you can fold it up and put it away. You push this in, in. Each compartment they can use diapers, uh, bottles, pacifier as their own bag till like till it becomes a great handbag. I believe that we are too much caught up in the gadgets and gizmos. In 20 years, when this child becomes an adult, they're not going to go to the parent and say, oh, thank you so much for that great stroller that you bought. They're going to say, thank you for providing your loving arms for me and, and creating a wonderful bond. It's not about all these gizmos. For girls, we're definitely seeing a big upswing in modern clothing and modern, I mean, bright, bright colors. You're going to see lots of yellows, blues, neons, everything that's going to pop back at you. Um, you're definitely going to see, um, you know, adult trends um, going back down to the babies. You're going to see bright neon yellow jeggings. You're going to see bright pink fun prints, all about fun this spring and summer. Play with the things and you would swat at them. I 
love following the trends for my son. I think it's so much fun. I love seeing what celebrity kids are wearing. Like Gwen Stefani's kids always dress so cute. Uh, Sandra Bullock's son always dresses so cute. I see them in graphic prints. I see them in neon. Benjamin loves white, which is always hard to keep clean, but he actually cares about what he's wearing too. Are they doing, are they playing?